ladies and gentlemen um, welcome this is going to be the energy vibration of the full moon that is coming up in the month of September so we are going to be starting out with the energies and I want to say thank you for um, returning thank you for supporting my channel um, this um, is going to be a new series that I'm going to um, start doing um, the full reading you can um, receive on um, um, the full reading um, you'll be able to receive on um, on demand on my website okay alrighty um, so let's look at you air sign people to see what is coming up for you guys um, I want to say thank you again thank you for your wonderful support likes and shares this is a new series that we're just going to begin and this is going to be the series of the new moon for each and every month we are going to have a new moon series okay this new moon series is going to entail the zodiac energies um, the um, the general energies and um, the love and then money series okay it's going to be a full-blown reading so um, what you don't receive you can um, go on on demand for it now we're going to be starting with the zodiac energies for the air people so let's see what is coming up for the air people um, the we're going to do the Sun and then we're going to do the moon and then we are going to be doing okay so and the outcomes right okay so for you guys for you here sign um, you are going to be um, and um, they're saying that that is <laughs> for the Sun people so if you were born if you hair sign people because the air sign people this is for um, the Aquarius the Gemini and Libra okay if you were born in the earth sign if you were born in the um, between the hours of 12 midnight and 6 p.m. Um, this is your energy vibration of the zodiac energy for the month of September so again if you were born 12 a.m. midnight and 6 p.m. between 12 a.m. and 6 p.m. in the evening this is going to be the Sun raising sign of you Aries okay so whether you're an Aquarius a Gemini or Libra this is your Sun sign now you're going to be working with a lot of Pisces Pisces comes up and whenever you're working the Sun signs working with Pisces that means you are going to be having um, these Pisces people coming in your life and helping you to work out certain situations in your life okay so whatever the situation is that is transpiring you're going to be connecting with the Pisces people okay and the Pisces people are going to be coming in to help you Sun sign people to remove certain aspect and awaken your intuition okay because the Pisces work with um, the intuition and work with the world the planet you're going to be working with is Uranus now when Uranus comes in your birth chart or you have to work with the planet of Uranus now it's going to be um, the um, effect of your career um, your career will be changing because Pisces is working with you Sun sign people with Uranus and it's as if they're going to be shaking Uranus basically shakes up the world and Uranus is also the zodiac um, the um, the planet that rules the Aquarians so especially the, the Aquarians um, with relationship with a Pisces or with work your life is going to be a little bit shaken up so um, if this could happen after the 15th of the month that you realize that your relationship your um, work career is being especially for the Aquarians it's going to affect you in that area this is your um, 
um, planet that is supporting you so this is going to be good and here you are you Aquarians okay so the effect on you Aquarians life it could be if you're in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion or a Pisces there is going to be changes in your relationship if it is uh, um, where you have a situation to be dealt with um, in work it, it's going to be shaken up your life okay so be aware of this for the Gemini's and Libra it could bring you some luck um, especially if you're working because it's the, the Aquarians are going to be helping you guys out in whatever the situation is the Aquarians are going to be coming um, to help you out and Pisces it Pisces in Aquarian is you know this is one of the signs that you must be aware of the one of the planets that you must be aware of because Uranus is always shaking you up Uranus comes in your life to basically shake um, sh uh, shake you up a little bit to um, you know let you be assertive about certain things and um, let you be um, very much aware about certain things to find out um, what is going to affect you and when uranus comes especially um for you guys it is uranus is the god who rules the night sky and the heavens okay astrological um, um celestial body the hairs is name so uranus comes and the, the planet of uranus bestow genuine um, genius on you okay so you ear signs are always very intelligent and it's going to um, a bit store um, some really really um, excited things so if you were looking for, to build a new career for yourself and that sort of a thing Uranus is going to be coming in and this is for the people the Sun sign people this is for the people who are ruled by the Sun now we're going to look at the moon people who are the moon people these are the people who were born after 6 p.m. and 12 p.m. at midnight so if you were born between the hours of 6 p.m. and 12 mid and um, 12 midnight um, you are the moon people so most of the time you're always very psychic you're always um, very very psychic now you guys are going to be working with a scorpion and Mars so it's all about shaking up careers and working with um, these people now um, for you moon people the scorpions are going to be coming in and aligning you and, and uh, you know uh, relieve revealing secrets to you guys so, so the scorpions are going to be coming in and revealing secrets to you guys about your career about your work about your studies whatever you're doing um, someone who's a scorpion or has uh, the rising sign or sun sign of a scorpion is going to come in your life and reveal something to you about your work life and about work okay and this is going to be good um, this is going to be very good because um, what this moon energy is basically doing um, for you guys is really aligning you aligning you with the correct careers some of you could be feeling for some time now that your career um, you know you're getting a little bit tired or it's the same thing all the time and you're looking for um, something better out of your career you're looking for um, something um, better out of your career and you're going to be aligned with the correct um, career to to use so for you Earstein, I'm seeing that this full moon is going to bring relationship changes because we have the Pisces and the Scorpio for we have the Sun sign the Pisces and we have the moon sign the scorpion and the planets that we have and the way the planets come is that um, for the sun sign people it is saying that you Aquarians are going to be having an effect if you're in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion you it's going to affect your relationship this full moon is going to affect your relationship so whatever and whoever you're in with a relationship that is a Pisces this is going to affect uh, for the rest of you guys it's looking okay I'm not seeing any obstacles I'm not seeing anything that is happening for the moon people 
um, you have the scorpions and the scorpions they're going to be coming to help you it could be on the work floor it could be working together to build something together but it's all about career it's all about um, you advancing in your career and the, the, the someone who's a Scorpio is going to be helping you doing that because it's as if they see the potential in you and they're going to be aligning you in this way now the outcomes is the Sagittarius so if you're in relationship with a Sagittarius they are going to be bringing you luck especially luck in love so if you're in a relationship with a Sagittarius they're going to be bringing you luck and luck with love and it's going to be very very positive because uh, Venus is going to go in retrograde but um, whatever the situation or whatever that was transpiring you're going to be seeing this situation really happening for you where this the, the Sagittarius are coming in and they are going to be aligning you in a wonderful positive positive energies and wonderful positive things okay so um, this is good and this is going to be positive for you guys I'm seeing that this period is all about love for a lot of you people whatever is happening whatever is transpiring it's all all about love um, it's all about the career and love for this full moon for you guys it's all about career and love I'm sorry I need to take a picture of this it's all about career and love that is going to be coming up for you guys and it's going to be wonderful because what is happening is that there is changes it's as, it's as if Uranus is here I hope you guys can see this it's as if I'm so sure <laughs> it's as if Uranus is here and Uranus is going to um, help you to shake up your career a little bit so that you can be aligned with the right energies around you okay so this is going to be good this is going to be extremely positive whatever is happening you Aquarius is going to affect you guys you Aquarius is going to affect you guys and what we need to do is to um, basically align ourselves. Okay, so for the next segment of the reading, go to um, on demand.